adventure. It's my birthday today now. Nelson had his birthday, now I have mine. <laughs> anyway, okay. So we are going to Petra today. We're at our hotel in Amman and the tour group is picking us up at 7.15, so any minute now. And we are driving about two hours out to Petra. We're gonna be going to Petra, Wadi Rum, spending the night in the desert, and coming to the Dead Sea the next day on the way back to Amman. Now we are so bougie. <laughs> like, you should have seen us trying to pack for the desert. <laughs> This was all Nelson's idea. He's been dying to go to Petra. Yes. So we're really excited. All right, we're getting closer to Petra with, with our group, Musafa. He's our driver. We've got Z, Nelson, and Keisha. Okay, we just walked into Petra. We're just coming into the entrance way. That's my group up ahead. If you're tired, you can get a horse and carriage to take you down the hill, but I just feel bad for these horses. They're working so hard, so we're gonna choose to walk and enjoy the scenery. You guys are gonna see it when I see it too. I've been waiting a long time for this. I told Michelle when we met that I wanted to come here. And we're making it happen today. And I really can't believe, I can't believe I'm here right now. Seven wonders of the world. We are here. Oh my. I just can't get enough of this place. It's beautiful. <laughs> We're in Petra. We just want to show you we're sitting at this little tea house outside of the treasury. Happy birthday, baby girl. It's my birthday. And I just got to fulfill my birthday fantasy. All I wanted was pictures with a camel. And the guides here just literally gave us the camel's leash. <laughs> this is Daisy. She's been letting us take photos all day. Poor girl. She's a sweetheart. She's been working hard all day, so we're showing her some love. Her name was Daisy, Daisy. the camel. He, they literally just handed us the leash and let us walk the camel around Petra. Like she, it was amazing. Like me and Nelson had our own time to do our photo shoot with the camel, and, and she was listening to us say like sit and stay, and we walked her around, and we had like a good like half hour yeah. just hanging out with our own camel. <laughs> we was, wanted to pawn off Daisy. I was, it was saying, a, after a while, like, we were like, someone does, take any, her. does anyone want this camel? And finally, there was like these two guys from Europe. They're like, we'll yes, take yes, her. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> is walking Daisy around. Very nice job. But it was awesome because in the beginning they were trying to make everyone pay, you know, to be with the camels and stuff, but then they just came over and gave her to us. So No, it's that they looked at Michelle, they were like, Oh, beautiful. But <laughs> and I was like So check out this It's a backdrop. This backdrop you guys. Yo. <laughs> We had this to walk, is, how far was it to get here? It was a, like almost two miles. It's it's a long hike, so we are sweaty and hot. Our We actually um, had a tour guide that was with a couple other people, and they kept walking, and we were like, we just want to chill here <laughs> at the tea house in front of the treasury. So our, yeah. our group is like still walking, but what? got some awesome pictures, which I'm going to be putting on Instagram and Facebook soon. Yeah, man, we're having a great time, bro. <laughs> Let's give everybody, like, 
let's show you guys what's going on behind us. So um, there's a little tea house where we're sitting. So I'll kind of turn around so you can see. There's like little um, souvenir shops and refreshments. And then back around here is this gorgeous view. So if you're ever thinking about coming here, there is a lot of walking um, entailed. It's up to you how far you want to walk, of course, but just to get to the treasury alone to walk there and then back to the entrance is already a lot. So if you're not into walking a lot, just be prepared um, to wear some really good shoes, some cool clothing. Um, a lot of people have asked me how to dress when you come here. You do need to be dressed modest whenever you're out in Jordan with your shoulders and your knees covered. Um, but over here um, near Petra walking around because it's so hot, I've seen some tourists in tank tops. So I took my scarf off um, just because I want to get some sun and cool off a little bit. And I think it's totally fine and appropriate here. But there are a lot of people walking around from other cultures that are fully covered. So you want to be um, just respectful of what you're wearing when you come around here. What's up, Nelson? Did you have fun with the camel? I, I don't know. <laughs> I'm glowing, look, I'm glowing, glowing. I gotta say, this was all his idea. This was his, um, you know, dream that he came up with for us to come here, and I'm so the happy pictures, The pictures don't, don't do it justice, honestly. Like, when you walk in through... What's it called, maybe? The... It's like, the, I forget what it's called, too, but it's, but like, it's like, like where the waterways were. And then it opens up to this, it's just... I can't explain it. headed to the um, desert we're gonna sleep in the desert tonight so I don't know how good the Wi-Fi will be there or how good our 4g will be out in the desert but we'll try to come back on when we're out there in our tent I'm cheesing, Michelle, when look, you I'm to ask you more about this trip yes anyone that's thinking about coming here of course I will give you guys all the details you know me I've got like a notebook of information now how to get here what to do We've been doing tons of research, right? Um, we had to learn everything on our own. <laughs> on our own, you guys are gonna have. <laughs> we'll plan it out for you. Such an advantage. Yeah. But it's uh, awesome. Just with these two things that we've done, it's just, just amazing. Like I said, we'll try to come back when we're in the desert in a little while. Happy birthday, Michelle! Thank you. Love you guys. <laughs>